From a distance, it looks like a ship standing in the sea, but actually it is a small town, which has become a complete ruin today. At one time, more than 7,000 people lived on this small island. It had all the facilities that a city should have, including schools, hospitals, town halls, swimming pools, shops and cinemas. But today, the whole island looks like a ghost. Let's know, friends. This island is called Hasima. This island is shaped like a battleship. If seen, the other islands are quite green. But Asima Island is a huge rock rising out of the sea where plantations are negligible. Let me tell you one Kuru 65 Lake tons of coal was extracted from the bottom of the sea near this island. Such a dense population has not been found in any country of the world till date. But there was room for only two workers to sleep, and the third worker had to sleep in a cubby. As for the mine, it was dug a kilometer below Hasima Island where the temperature was 35 degrees Celsius and the humidity was 95%. The work of workers in these harsh conditions was by no means without danger. Many workers have lost their lives while working on the coal mine of Hazima Island. Therefore, on January 15, 1974, the company closed the coal mine. Thousands of jobless workers left Hazima Island overnight. In the history of Hazima Island, an entire generation of humans lay here for many years, the Japanese government sealed off the island, and violators were severely punished. Many people said that Japan wants to hide the reality of the forced labor camp here from the world. But Japan said that this rule was made by them to stop theft on the island. Sima was rediscovered in the 21st century and became quite famous in the form of a ghost town. The government has tried several times to repair the buildings here, but they have not succeeded because their concrete has deteriorated. Many buildings here have collapsed due to typhoons and other buildings are close to collapse. Only a small part of the island has been repaired and tourists are allowed to visit it. 